instead of putting away money towards existing debt, let's take a look at maybe putting money towards true expenses. And you can watch this video here that talks a little bit more about that. We want to be able to put money away for large true expenses for those times when these experiences end up popping up. Let's say you pay an average of $500 a month towards your debt, whether it's student loans, car payments, housing, you're just paying $500 towards that. Well, let's try sectioning this off. Instead of 500, let's say you pay off $200 a month for those loans. Now, yes, those loans will eventually take longer to pay off, but what are you gonna do with this $300? We're gonna put these towards a true expense budget category. And this gives you the ability, when those emergency situations come, to pay that off. You're gonna put this money into an expense category that's able to cover auto issues, appliances dying. Now, what have you done? Well, you prevented new debt from happening. The ability to put this money away to more or less prevent new debt allows you to break that cycle. So you're actually still paying off your debts, but you have the ability to have the small fund in order to pay off for these emergency situations or these true expenses as we call them. It's about building that cycle to prevent this future debt from happening. And overall, you'll feel better about yourself.